Welcome back to our series of interviews with international leaders about the business impact of the coronavirus crisis. All European countries are now more or less under lockdown and the level of uncertainty for companies has increased dramatically. How do European companies and leaders adjust to having their employees working from home? How do they service their customers? What kind of future scenarios are they preparing themselves for? Here are the answers. It is my pleasure to introduce you to Martin Ikema. Martin is based in Vienna and he's the Chief Operating Officer of the hospitality company Vienna House Hotel Group. Actually, there's only one, one word for this and that's uh, dramatic. Uh, the impact is um, uh, like the, the whole virus is impacting the world. It's a catastrophe for especially the travel and tourism uh, industry. At this moment, um, we, uh, we have 52 hotels and 47 are already uh, uh, we put back on zero. Besides of four or five hotels in Germany, um, we are operating all the hotels, let's say, on a standby mode, meaning we don't have guests in the hotels unless there are some requests from uh, governments or diplomats or expats. Uh, where we still provide uh, very limited service, but yeah, we are um, hosts, so we don't want to let our people or our guests down also in this kind of uh, periods, especially when they don't can come home. So we have made some exceptions, but let's say 95% of our hotels are at this moment uh, empty. We have in total three and a half thousand uh, employees working uh, for us. But at this moment, uh, Philip, uh, 70 to 80 percent of our employees are sitting at home under the different conditions. Um, of course, uh, we started already beginning of March, the second week of March, that asking everybody to build off as much possible holidays uh, over time, which is still, of course, applicable in, the, in our industry. And of course, as well, um, taking the possibility of uh, unpaid leave. The future will look, of course, a little bit different. Uh, we are still in attendance of, um, of many local authorities. What kind of plans, what kind of support they will give to our industries. Um, and as you know, as good as I, uh, some uh, countries are better prepared and also especially financially prepared to take such a big uh, crisis. Uh, a country like Germany, uh, a country like Austria, they are very organized, they have systems in place. So where are we are still waiting for uh, Czech Republic, to Poland, uh, Romania, other countries where these kind of plans are still in preparation, I have to admit. But um, the processes are still there, uh, a bit complicated uh, to have everybody on board. And, there you have uh, limited funds uh, as well. I'm very pleased to hear that uh, from, from my colleague is that, especially from the banks, is a very big amount of understanding. With the owners uh, regarding where we are leasing the, the buildings in general as well, and we, we come already to agreements that we, we don't have to pay the lease for a certain period of time. Um, and the third stakeholder, of course, uh, where we are very dependent of uh, is what I mentioned before, are the, uh, the local authorities, in which way they can support us. If there is no support, uh, then, and it's not only for Vienna House, but for each and every hotel business, but actually for every business at this moment, when there is not an appropriate uh, support, this, I can tell you, will not take long. It will be three to six months and I think 60 70 percent of uh, the companies will be not uh, there anymore or let's say uh, having applied for uh, bankruptcy the plan B is in this case uh, try to survive in the most professional way by putting your 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 teams let's say everything while you're standing for your values um, still on the first place um, to, cook, to, to keep your company and to guide your company through this very difficult time. But um, 
we don't know where it ends. We don't know how long the desert or how big the ocean is at this moment.